Hello scientists, today we're going to be investigating sound. Sound is all around us and whether it's the sound of a person's voice, the sound of keys jingling, or the sound of a book slamming on the ground, sound is produced when objects vibrate. So here I have my tuning fork and these right here are called tines. These tines vibrate thousands of times per second. So it's hard to see them vibrating because they move so fast. But when I play it in slow motion, you can see the vibrations. We cannot see the air molecules bouncing off the fork because they are invisible to our eyes. But we can see sound in something thicker like water. The splash pattern in water is similar to what happens in the air with sound bouncing off in all the different directions. So as scientists, we have discovered that sound creates vibrations. In this last experiment, we are going to get to observe sound waves again. We are going to be trying to make salt dance. Thank you for experimenting with me today. Please remember that sound is energy, just like light or electricity. Sound is made when objects vibrate. These sound vibrations travel in waves by pushing air molecules together. The vibrations can be very powerful. The stronger the vibrations, the louder the sound. And then sound is measured in decibels. I'm going to encourage you to experiment with sound.